President, colleagues, if we want to be climate neutral by 2050, we have to focus on transport. We know that the transport sector is the only sector in the EU where emissions they have increased. That trend cannot continue. Maritime, aviation, road transport all have an important part to play in this regard. Today we are debating and voting about new CO2 standards for passenger vehicles and vans. And I have to say that I'm not fully satisfied about the trialogue outcome. Yes, indeed, we have to cut emissions from road transport, but we should do it in technology-neutral way. We, as the politicians, we shouldn't be choosing winners and losers in the industry. This regulation entails that from 2035 onwards, all new vehicles should be electric or hydrogen vehicles. This regulation would phase out internal combustion engines, and I don't think that this is a right approach. Technology diversity is needed where all technologies, including electrification, hybridization, hydrogen, but also sustainable and renewable fuels can play a role, and we should also encourage those innovations. We should set the target, and industry should find out what is the most efficient and best technology to achieve this target. And we know also that for too long, we have been focusing only to tailpipe emissions. So I think this is a positive step here, that the new regulation will now introduce a common EU methodology by 2025 for assessing the full life cycle of CO2 emissions of cars and vans placed in the EU market.